What's up, Yogi? It's Hero, and today we're going to go over how to get into your flying pigeon or how to get into it deeper, especially if you feel a lot of tightness around your glutes. Um, we're going to dive right into it. So you're going to need a towel, preferably a wood floor. That would be great. Open up your towel so that it's nice and long like this. And we're going to come into a pigeon pose-ish. I call it a lazy pigeon when I teach it in class. Um, and it's going to be lazy because you're not completely squaring off the hips here. We're just going to focus all the attention into this front outer butt, outer glute. Put your foot onto one end of the towel, knee onto the other end of the towel. And I want you to turn your chest over to face this front leg and put a lot of pressure down. If you're not feeling anything in the glute, it's probably because you're rounding out your back and taking a lot of pressure into your back. So use your hands down onto the ground, especially for this exercise, to straighten out the spine a little bit more. Keeping the belly hugging in, you're going to start to drive pressure down through this front shin, foot side and knee side. And then the trick to actually coming into the pose is how hard you kick this leg into your arms in Flying Pigeon. So we're going to mimic that motion here, where you're going to kick the foot forward, and slide it back. Kick the foot forward, slide it back, and we're gonna do this three more times. Just so you can start to understand if your knee is taking a lot of pressure, lean out to the side a little bit more so you drive a little bit more attention into the glute. All right, so just two more. That's exercise one, my glute is definitely burning. Exercise two, we're gonna dive right into it again. You can leave this front foot here and slide this back leg in. And the idea is you're trying to engage and flex your butt as much as possible. So um, keep your, keep your <laughs> keeping your foot flexed like this into the ground is gonna be harder, but the idea is you're lifting your butt up, coming onto the top of the knee-ish. If this is not feeling good for your knee, point the toes. It's gonna be a lot easier to roll up. And if this is hard, you can always use hands just to brace yourself a little bit. As you start to open up and strengthen in the glutes, you can get a little bit lighter, maybe throwing some peace signs, maybe just an index finger, maybe no hands. All right, so we're gonna try the pose out with these engagements, these exercises coming into the pose. Okay, so move the towel out of the way. I like to come into it from a figure four. So we're going to come into a figure four here, flex the foot, snuggle the shin as high up into the armpit as possible. And I like to curl my toes into the bicep. I'm going to lean forward and kick, kick and push, kick and push, kick and push. And that's going to provide a little bit more space, a little bit more engagement to come into the pose. Give it a try. <laughs> 